People in Polk County also have a place to donate goods to the Bahamas. Eight on your side, Stacy De Silva reports. Toothpaste, loofahs, even big bottles of bleach, all things the people of the Bahamas will need as they recover from Hurricane Dorian. Polk County law enforcement is teaming up with a Florida charity to give back. Cleaning supplies, items for children. Diana Mitchell knows what it's like to see her home turn to rubble. I lost a house in a fire um, in 2012 and lost everything. And it was important to me to be able to help someone because I, I know what it's like to, to not have the things you need. She was one of the first people to bring donations to the Haines City Police Department. Thank you all so much. After Dorian decimated the Bahamas, the PD reached out to Miami-based nonprofit The Smile Trust. We basically said, how can we help? And uh, they, they gave us a, a, list, a list of things that we could collect, and uh, we've been doing that here. And the donations have started piling up from around the community. You know, this is just what we do. You know, if we can help, we do as much as we can. Other drop-off locations across eastern Polk County include the Davenport Police Station and Miracle Toyota. Donations will be collected through the month of September. For a full list of drop-off locations, visit this story on our website, WFLA.com, or our WFLA app. In Polk County, Stacey DeSilva, 8 on your side. And we have a list of 